Okay, just kidding. <laughs> Don't do that. I'm not being shady. I'm just being honest. You guys know i have a podcast it's linked down below it's nicole jacqueline podcast i post new episodes every single friday my slime shop is restocked and it is linked down below it's slimebyjacqueline.com this is part two of my two-part series of my snoop slimes review because i purchased 20 slimes and like close to 400 dollars of slime very crazy very crazy video like this video if you guys saw the part one video if you have not seen it yet um i will link it for you guys in a card up here you should go watch that video first or or you can watch it honestly whenever in the last video we reviewed 10 slimes and i have 10 more we have to go through so those are going to be coming right up you guys i have so much snoop slimes slime now comment down below what i should do with this most recent purchase should i try to recreate the snoop slimes slimes that i purchased from snoop slimes in an upcoming video if you want that make sure to subscribe down below for a possible recreating video of the snoop slimes video i could literally just be like recreating the charlie and then my version and her version kind of a fun video right if you want that subscribe down below and like this video and i will do it for you guys it would be a fun way to test if i know what i'm talking about whenever i play with the slime I'm, I'm always talking about how i think i know what's in it so i'm curious to know like how smart i really am how much do i actually know my stuff when it comes to what is actually in the slime so if you want that like the video comment down below turn the bell on subscribe like make sure you are here present present yourself mark yourself as here present a truly a gift okay all right let's hop on in to part two of this video rolling it off we are going to begin with the charlie because we have to i freaking love her gosh if for any reason she's watching this girl can you just please like dm me i'll make you well check your dms how about that because i keep trying to send her slime I love her so much, like truly. Okay, so here you have the base for the Charlie. I want to try the new cold brew actually. Oh, it's actually not scented like coffee. It's like unscented. <laughs> maybe the maybe the add-ins are scented though. We'll see about that. I kind of want to play with it without the add-ins first. I love the glitters and how very on point the coffee is coffee color okay now it is time to build this so we have this little cream this is there's no way this is unscented it's unscented is it unscented or am i just like i'm really smelling it i don't smell anything <laughs> i'm not being shady i'm just being honest maybe potentially let's build this little drink here so you have a little like glue all definitely glue all okay Ooh. love to do this love little drizzle okay and then now i kind of want to sell one of these in my slime shop be kind of fun right if i recreate it i'll definitely sell it in my slime shop <laughs> and we have the two little cubes so cute this looks so good okay so we have the charlie here it's time to mix it together and like oh this looks so pretty that like gorgeous marbling i kind of want to let it fall out You guys, this is such a cool slime. It is not scented, but it's very fun. And I kind of like that. You know, I think it's definitely like, and I would love to have a little caramel, but it's okay. I don't know why I thought it was scented. Okay, I'll stop saying that now. We get it, Nicole, it's not scented. This is a very nice texture though. Oh my. So good. Mm. 
I kind of love this. Oh my, okay, leave those out. <laughs> Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh! <laughs> Literally lovely. Oh, I low key hate that, but it's worth it. Just gets everywhere, man. <laughs> like, that just has no limits. So, honestly, love this. I do not believe it is scented. I, I don't know why I'm so thrown off by that. I think because it's like, it's almost like a very thing, it's a very rare thing now for a slime to not have a scent, but. You know, I think it is also, someone has to do it. Like some people don't like scents in their slime. I am not one of those people, but <laughs> I think it is cool that there is someone else out there that does that. We have to do one that I have been dying to do since I literally started this video and I have been waiting, ma'am. This is the Cosmic Brownie Slime with a Cosmic Brownie Clay add-in. This is actually a very like large amount of slime and everything. So I'm actually very excited for this one. So we have Cosmic Brownies. I would love to recreate this one. If I do any, oh, it's a snow fizz. Okay, sorry, I got a little excited. I always forget that I'm like on camera sometimes. <laughs> oh, so good. Love a little Cosmic Brownie and we'll add the Play add in. Love, oh, I love how this feels. You guys, like, imagine assembling this. You have to put all the beads in there. But that took a long time. It's time to mix this together. Oh, this is totally Daiso, right? Oh, yeah. I forget how great Daiso is. You can just tell by how it like tears like that. Oh my gosh. Look at that. Like why is Daiso the best clay ever? Daiso with the snow fizz. Wow. Oh my gosh, you guys. This literally is like my favorite thing. Oh my gosh, the mixing of it. I can't explain to you how great this feels. It's a snow fizz with that Daiso clay. It's like the type of clay that it just, it just felt like the most airy, most amazing clay there ever was. Ever, ever was. <laughs> wow. Oh, beads are flying. This is gonna get really inflating because it's just like, it's just in the principle of it. It's, it already feels so fluffy. It's so fluffy, I'm gonna die. <laughs> Please don't die. <laughs> wow. I'm sorry, what? Why is this so good? So good. <laughs> oh. I love this one more than I thought I would when I first played with it. I was like, oh, cool. When I first saw it, I mean, but now I'm like, wow, this. <laughs> is it. <laughs> I am living for this one. The best part is about this is because that little clay topper came in a large enough jar, I can put the excess in here because of all the clay. Let's do this one. This is the aloe vera jelly slime. Ooh, I bet you it's super nice. Oh, cute says Snoop approved. Love the labels. Labels are very fun. Oh, I love the scent of this. Aloe vera vibes. Oh, it smells like so refreshing. Alrighty. I love a thick jelly. Oh, this is so good. Okay. I'm upset. Oh, I love when slime like does that. 
It's like kind of like triphobia vibes. <laughs> I need to make more jelly slimes. They're so fun. Aloe vera. Mm. Very nice. This is so, so good. Jelly slimes for, whoa, for the win. Very fun. Love this one. This is so much fun. Do you think I love it? Have I said it enough? Have I said it enough? Okay, this next one is called banana milk. This looks very fun. I love, I bet you it's like a super nice thick and glossy, like, mmm, yes. Banana is the best scent, period. I don't want to hear it. I'm um, period. It's the best. Oh, so good. So thick. Big glue wall vibes. Glue wall is just the best glue, honestly. Like, I'm sorry, but like it is. <laughs> charms they are little bananas they're like really tiny they're really cute though like really a little small s-m-o-l small small very glossy very nice Ooh. literally love this So good. Banana. Thick and glossy forever. Like, that's the best. Did I just see a little charm that I missed? No. I'm going crazy. Wow. We love that. <laughs> Okay. So fun. Banana, comment down below if you like banana smell because I love banana smell. But I feel like banana is also one of those scents people either love or they hate. It's like one, just one of those, you know? You guys, this next one is literally inspired by a brand I love. Oh my gosh, I have to be right though. They sell a honeycomb face mask as well. They're a very clean beauty brand. I don't know, but <laughs> TBD, we'll find out. We'll get back to you. So love this, love how this is. Um, it's just like such a fun slime. I love like this branding that is inspired by a real brand. It's very, very cool. Oh wow, green tea, vanilla and green tea scented. This is my new favorite slime scent. Finally, I've wanted this for such a long time now. Oh wow, that's very thick. Just, just how I like the slime to be. Extremely thick. The smell is to die for. Like, wow. Absolutely phenomenal. Love. This is so good. This texture is everything. It's like just what you would think it would, it should feel like. Like if you were literally applying a face mask, like one of these like mud masks, that's how it would look, you know? Just, just like that. Oh my gosh, it smells so good. The inflation. Oh my gosh. 
Yes, ma'am. This is probably my favorite one so far for this part two, but you have to go watch part one to find out my top favorites and my least favorites from part one. That vanilla and green tea blend is just like perfect. Like you don't want just green tea, but the vanilla really just ties it all together very, very well. I am inspired, truly inspired. Yes, inflation work. Fall over my table and make a mess. It's just work inflation. Okay, animal cracker ice cream. Very um interesting kind of idea, but really cool. I haven't ever seen this done before. It matches my water bottle. It matches my whole vibe right now. This looks so great. I wonder what it smells like. Ooh, very nice like vanilla blend here. Vanilla, animal cracker, love that blend. So there are some little stars on top and then these are the same beads that were in that cosmic brownie slime. Very fun. Alrighty. Oh, wow. What in tarnation? What is this? Oh, I think it's like a, okay, I think it's a clear slime. Like it's a clear glue based slime, but it what, but it's a cloud, it's a clear, isn't that called something different? <laughs> These are gonna fall out for sure. The beads like this are really fun in theory, but because they're just so silky, they're gonna fall out um, in a slime like this. But if they're in a slime, like a, a slushy slime or a slime that just is like, glue truly they do adhere much better i'm not complaining but like just saying from like they're gonna fall out definitely but they really make a really fun addition to the slime still love this yes ma'am <laughs> let's inflate it inflate it up it kind of okay correct me if i'm wrong isn't an icy texture, technically a clear cloud. LMK. <laughs> Maybe it's not a clear, I don't know. But I know that I love it. <laughs> it's very beautiful. Very nice vanilla buttercream kind of scent. Literally feels so nice. Love. Okay, that's literally so good. <laughs> I'm gonna pack that back into the jar here. Love this one. 10 out of 10 for me. Very impressed. I really haven't, I honestly don't dislike any of these so far. So that's a good sign. <laughs> I only have four left of my 24 and I'm just like very proud of myself for pushing through this because it can be like a long process, but it's also just like I'm playing with slime. Like how cool is that? Like why, how is my life this? I don't know, but I have to say this is my life because I decided to make it my life and it was the best choice ever. Like, you know, I could have just stopped doing this one day, but I just genuinely love it that much. Okay, next up we have blue raspberry, raspberry. <laughs> pronouncing all the letters today, aren't we? Blue Raspberry Boba. I just know I'm gonna love this. Blue Raspberry is my, this is my favorite color, my favorite scent, my favorite flavor. <laughs> I was like, no, I, I don't eat scents. <laughs> it's my favorite. I know I'm gonna love it. it. It's a jelly. Blue Raspberry is just like such a great scent. It never gets old. It never goes out of style. It's just always, always great. <laughs> Look at that. Oh my gosh, it's so cute. Now it's time. Okay, I love the straw so much, you guys. I can't get over how fun it is. Yes, that is a slime. Wow, the texture, the color, the boba. Oh my God. It looks so good. This is fantastic. I 
I love this. I also just love the idea of boba slimes. Like they're very fun. Okay, yeah. <laughs> love it's just like a very simple like thick clear slime but the blue raspberry scent the boba it just really adds a lot can you tell it is a clear those bubble pops girl 10 out of literal 10. <laughs> not actual not hypothetical not metaphorical literal 10. 10 as they say in tennessee they say 10 10, I'm like 10, I'm like 10. I'm just playing, I'm not being serious. You guys, we have three slimes left. Ah, yes. Okay, let's do Claire de Lune. It's a blue raspberry fish bowl. This is like such a classic labeling. Love this packaging, it's very fun. Um, So it's not scented. <laughs> I should have known that because in the past, I remember her clear slimes just never really were scented because scented slimes are hard to keep clearer. Okay, clear de lune. Oh, fishbowl slimes are like so classic. I forgot the feeling of poking into a fishbowl slime. Thank you, Snoop Slimes, for keeping fishbowl slimes alive because they're like, honestly, I'm still alive, but I'm barely breathing. They're like hanging. Oh my gosh, this is just so grand. The feeling of a fishbowl. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. It's so good. Wow. Honestly, truly gorgeous. Wow. <laughs> this slime makes me happy. Like, this is an amazing texture. And it's not scented. So, and I think I'm changing my mind a little bit because it really is a great slime. The beads are so nice. Comparison to like slushy slimes or Bingsu or Floam, those like smaller beads, they don't hurt my hand, but they're just not as pleasant to crunch. But fishbowl beads are just such a soft disc that when they're in a slime together, they're just so much softer and more pleasant to play with, which is just so nice. Love, maybe, love. <laughs> I want to inflate this like beyond belief. And literally no fallout, let's, let's do a little test. Okay, just kidding, <laughs> don't do that, don't do that. But that's not fallout, that's literally like intentional ripping. Because usually fallout for me is considered like, if I'm doing a generic like this, and there's fallout that I'm like, okay, but there's not, so period. Very good. <laughs> Love. Claire de Luna, big, big fan. People can do hard things. Can I just stop coding TikTok? Like it's not, it's not good. Let's do, I wanna save watermelon sugar ha, to the last one. So next up we have honey do boba. Love a good honey do boba. Honey do ya, do ya boba. What am I, <laughs> okay. I would rather film with this kind of attitude than like an actual tood, okay? This smells just like an actual honey do, honey do. Here we have it. Oh my gosh, the gloss is unreal. It's like, 
a very like gummy texture. Like it's like, it looks like a gummy. I love this texture. It's so fun. The same texture almost as the blue raspberry boba, which I love that. Honestly, I'm feeling inspired to make more boba slimes that are that are like different than just like actual boba. I'm sure it's actually a thing, but it's fun to kind of like put a little twist on it. The boba. Love. Oh, it looks so good. Oh my god. Wow. Wow is this wow is the word. I love this honeydew. The scent is amazing. I it I don't know how to explain it, but it's like a gummy texture. You can kind of see how it kind of acts. It kind of has that thickness to it. It kind of looks like a candy. Like if a gummy, a thick gummy was a thing, that's what it would be. Okay. Okay. <laughs> this is super nice, you guys. Boba slimes. Wow. So fun. Okay. Pop this in the con. Oh no! In the container. Okay, so lastly we have watermelon sugar beautiful slime i'm sure it literally smells phenomenal <gasps> is this a oh it is this is like giving me barbie vibes hey guys so my big camera just died for the actual fourth time i have two batteries but i'm gonna have to get like three it's fine but you know what it's all good you guys thankfully we are blessed with two camera angles. Sometimes you just gotta do it. So here we have this little angle here. <laughs> so this is the watermelon sugar slime. You guys can hear the difference now in how the audio will sound using this camera versus an actual DSLR. But you know what? It's the last slime of the video. It's gonna be, okay. <laughs> Alrighty, here we go. Wow, this is, Beautiful and scented. <laughs> the watermelon scent, yes. Very thick. Again, with that almost gummy texture, which I like love. And these watermelon charms. Okay, miss. Okay, miss watermelon. We see you. If you guys remember, this gives me vibes of a slime she used to have called Barbie. I might, I don't know if she's still, but it's a very OG slime. Um, this kind of reminds me of that, but love this. I just bought watermelon slices for my slime shop. So I've been thinking of some fun watermelon slimes. I love how this one is. Very fun. So cute. Oh my gosh. Yes. <laughs> Literally so nice. So nice. To being a beautiful slime. Love. Absolutely. So good. Okay, you guys, I truly loved these. My favorite one from part two, I would have to say, would be the green tea face mask. I really loved that. Honestly, love this one. You guys know I loved that Claire de Luna one. I really just loved all of these so much. So if you have not seen part one, I'll link it down below for you guys. One more for good measure. But it's linked down below. Go check it out. 
like this video if I should do a recreating Snoop Slime's slime video on this channel. And if you want that, like the video, comment down below that you want a recreating video, and also turn the bell on to my channel to be notified when I upload that. Comment down below what slimes I should recreate too, because that would be helpful to know what ones you're like looking for. Right now I'm thinking the Charlie would be fun to recreate. Honestly, like kind of all of them be fun to create. So comment down below which ones you're thinking about. And yes, you guys, I will have part one down below. Go, go ahead and go watch it if you haven't watched it already. And I will also link in a card and down below um, the playlist to all of my Snoop Slimes videos I've done in the past. I've done literally so many of them. The link down below, go and check it out. And yes, you guys, I'll see you guys very soon. Bye. I'm sorry about this weird angle. I tried my best. I'm gonna order a new charger because I'm pretty sure my charger for my batteries is like broken. Anyways, love ya. See you later. I'll have my slime shop down below if you're curious. Go check it out. All right, bye.